All right, everybody. Good morning. Today is Thursday, February 16th. Been a little bit since we did a video, but uh, not too much going on. Well, and our tile setters had three days off. Um, they had an emergency, so our main guy didn't uh, wasn't here, so the, the helper didn't show either. A few new things for you to see. So let's look around a little bit and then go upstairs and see what everybody is up to. All right, just a little walk around of our tiles and stuff. We have all tiles. Um, the corner actually used to be full of the big tiles and uh, there is no more. They're all laid out and these are actually different ones than the ones that are over there and we're going to be today go buy some more because we're short and we have some new stuff we have our skim coat this is super fine our tile adhesive our regular adhesive and our, then our mondo skim coat and some portland cement uh, we got four toilets for upstairs and i have a fancy one for downstairs for my storage area. I don't know, I could have just bought these ones. So anyways, let's go upstairs. All right, we are upstairs. And this is what's going on. These are our floor tiles, which in here are working. Oh, and that, skim coat I was showing you guys, the uh, knob deck super fine gray is for that wall right there. Um, all the walls are going to be that way and they're going to be one feature wall in each room and this is the first one we did. It has lines in it we're going to try to fix it is from rolling it out so we were told to use a spray painter to kind of get a smooth look instead of having the, the roller lines in it and everything else is done in here they painted everything you can see the lower section of the wall hasn't had the, the final paint done on it uh, because what happens is these guys put tiles in it sort of splatters on the wall so they got to go back over Painting is going on. This wall hasn't been touched yet, and they haven't. Oh, maybe they have. I see roller lines on it. I'm not sure. I didn't think this one wall was going to be uh, done yet, but I guess it's being done because the first one was our practice wall. So I'm not sure how we're going to deal with this. I still said, but multiple coats uh, off the spray painter and it'll fix it. I don't know, we'll see. All right, and we're in the back left room. It's all tiled out. Well, the main floor is the bathroom and the, the uh, laundry area is not yet. And here is our gray wall again. And the skim coating is going on in here. And we're using fancy tools, which I don't know why the sandpaper is down. <sighs> and in here, oh, we got painting going on too. So we've got a little bit of everything going on in each room, seems like. These two rooms, we actually didn't buy tiles for the main floor, but tiles for everything else. The bathrooms and the, the laundry area, that's tiles, but we didn't, for some reason, we didn't buy this. We were only gonna do two rooms, and then I said, Miles, since we have the guys, might as well do all rooms. So we had bought the other tiles before I, we did that. I think we're gonna go back and get them today. All right, good morning, everybody. Today is February 18th, Saturday. 
did skip over a few days because it's sort of boring watching paint and dry type deal. So, <laughs> gotta get some progress before I put up a video for y'all. The skim coating and painting is still going on too. So anyways, let's go look around. So, starting to work the hallways. I think it's like the second coat on this. And we'll wander inside. Looking like we have the bathroom tiles. We'll go take a look inside here. All right. And they're setting up the tiles right now for the bathroom. And that's what it's looking like. But we're going to have a little slant to go down. They're trying to figure out here the little the step down for the UPVC how it's gonna work because I think they hung it too low. All right, so painting is finishing up in here. Just complaining, we got paint all over the tiles. That'll be fun. Anyways, put rubber coating down in here to get it ready for tiling. Um, the front left room and the back left room are going to be the ones that are going to be set up first. We're going to actually run, uh, get these ones going, um, these two rooms first so we can get our occupancy permit done. As long as there's one ready, they will approve it, is what my understanding is for us. Looking around, so everything is getting... The skim coating is done in most of these rooms, other than the hallway. It's what's coming down to the everything. So, we're cruising right along. I think this room is done for painting. Um, it just needs to be tiled. My understanding? Yes, it's done paint, being painted. Just needs to be tiled. I think this wall here might need to be coated. Um, maybe it's gotten one coat on it or something. Yeah, I can see there's lines from the rollers. So, not sure. We'll see how it goes. All right, one last little bit. There is our wonderful grout. The guys, they used a putty knife when they did our house. And uh, yeah, it didn't come out so good. This actually looks like a lot better setup that he has. It's just using like a sanding pad with a sponge. Top it off, this is what we are using for grout. Uh, the beige marawasa tile grout is what we're using. We brought back some tiles and I still had some leftovers, so I think we got like five sacks of these, so some leftover money. And it's only when you bring one back, you only get a uh, trade-in credit. They don't really give you money back. So she ended up using getting their tile grout instead of some different tile grout. We'll use this on the regular rooms, and then we will use a different tile grout for the bathrooms. That's uh, mold-resistant, and I think it's like waterproof sea beach type deal thing. 
Nice. All right, redo. The beige did not work out. So we're doing gray. <laughs> the gray is actually for something else, but hey, the, yeah, the beige is not a good color with these tiles. All right, and we're going to go with the gray. Better looking. It will dry to almost like what's inside the bag. Uh, the beige was too red. So, we'll go with gray and we'll do the whole place this way. The gray was originally for the outside tiles, for the hallways and stuff, and the beiges were for the rest of the tiles. So. We're just going to do all gray at the moment until I still changes her mind. <laughs> but the storage area is fine. We can just, uh, no one will see the storage area. So it's okay. And by the way, he's not really using a sponge or anything. That is... A slipper, a chinella, <laughs> and it works really good. All right, and here is the finished product of the gray for the tiles. All right, and here is the wall. It has one coat on it, and. It's actually did the whole wall. Got most of it done. So that's one coat. I'm trying to actually get up there, the electrical outlet, everything done over here because they're going to uh, put in the CCTV for this corner. And in here, we're gonna look at our bathroom tiles. So, there they are. All right, and in the back left room where they started painting this morning, it is done by the looks of things. Unfortunately, they got a lot of mess to clean up on the floor. And the fancy wall. All right, that is about it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed. And thank you for watching our video. And as always, goodbye.